Hey everyone, this is Brick Boy HD back to you with another video, and today I will be reviewing the Lego Batman movie, The Joker Balloon Escape. This is ages 6 to 12, set 70900, and it has 124 pieces. Now let's take a look at the minifigures. So first we have Batman. This is a different kind of Batman that we've gotten so far. It's if same old cow, but if you take off the head, you see he has a kind of a frown with one tooth hanging out of his mouth. And then if you turn it around, he has kind of a confused face or a shocked face on the other side. And the same um, cape as everyone, and that same body, belt, and leg piece for all of them. So, nothing's really new about that, so I'm not really going to talk much about Batman. Now, let's get take a look at the kind of new minifigure. He's sort of new to us. This is the Joker, and this is the version with the long coattail piece. Which also comes in the Scuttler and the Joker's training poly bag. He has that spiked, slick back hair, green hair piece. And this is a new face print from the Joker, Notorious Lowrider. And this, ha he has a evil grin, evil smile, and then he has a laughing face on the other side, so... And he has this little clip on the back, which is for the balloons, which I'll show you later. And then he has a, I think it's a different torso. There is no printing on the arms, um, like the um, one in the Joker's Notorious Lowrider has. And same printing on the legs from the Joker's Notorious Lowrider. And then the long coattail piece and no printing on the back because this thing is covering it. Now, let's take a look at the jo Joker's balloon jetpack thing. So, this is his balloon jetpack. Let me kind of raise the camera up, move the camera up a bit so you can see that, all of that. It's kind of really, really tall. And let me set the camera down and show you how Joker can just simply go onto there if it will stay. You can um, put his hands in these little um, paint thing handles and you clip him to the back of the balloon and you can raise the flames down if you please. And Oh, the one of the flames broke off, and you can have him escape from Batman, like in the movie, and the, um, the balloon has a bunch of balloons at the top, the same ones from the Angry Birds sets, which I didn't get any of those sets. They have the gun piece and the fire piece to represent exhausts, and then thing on the back to keep it st held up kind of and this little clip piece right here to hold up all the balloons there's a bunch of balloons on there so he can go up and get away from Batman so that's basically it for that and now here's the kind of the main part of it is the bomb piece it has the little computer here and then in the set, it just shows Batman can just go up to the computer and defuse the bomb before it blows up Gotham City. And if you want to create the bomb blowing up, you use this play feature where you push that down. I am. Like I just showed you there. So, And here's the timer for the bomb. That just clips onto the bomb, and there's a few st 
sticks of dynamite down there and then this whole um, handlebar piece can is what is holding the bomb up so that just goes on there and then you see these little clips under here they clip on to it and hold the bomb in the movie they actually put the bomb under water and I guess that's what this is supposed to be recreating it's a little steering wheel for a car that represents a turn thing to make the stuff go through the pipes and stuff because this is a power plant in the movie and then oh uh, I forgot to show you that Batman comes with this grappling hook piece where if you don't want him shooting it right now you could just clip that right there and have him just holding it and if you want to try to catch the Joker you could shoot that off like that and then when Joker's trying to escape you can um, hook the get the grappling hook to hook on to his balloon thing sometimes it stays sometimes it doesn't but and right now it's not wanting to I'm trying to find a good place to do it to hook it on to. I guess it could hook on to one of the balloons if you wanted to do that. But the idea is it hooks on to the thing and then Batman can hold back um, Joker from escaping. And then he. But then in the movie, he has to let the Joker go so he can defuse the bomb. So. That is basically it for the Joker balloon escape. Here's the whole um, box here. That's the whole box right there. And it shows Batman hanging on to the Joker, stopping him from escaping. Shows all the information. The movie logo at the top shows the Batman figure. And on the other side shows the play, the play feature. So, some Lego pieces fell, but um, shows Batman underwater to trying to defuse the bomb and Joker up at the power plant escaping. And then it shows Batman being laughed at by the Joker, the play feature of the exploding power plant, and shows you how you can hook a, on um, Joker to the balloon, the balloon thing. That's the bottom of the box, not much on there. But that is basically it for my um, bat, um, bat, uh, Lego Batman movie, Joker's Balloon Escape. And this set is $15 in the U.S. It's a pretty good price, and it also hooks on to the Mr. Freeze set, which I reviewed for you a little while back, like I said. And, um the scarecrow set also hooks on to those two and makes a big power plant build and once i can review the um scarecrow pizza delivery set i'll hook them all to at the end of the review i'll hook them all together and show you what that looks like so that is basically it for my review of the joker's balloon escape and i'll see you guys next time bye